Welcome to this edition of Mustang Corner. I'm Jessica Wollenberger. Today we have with us Connie Kennedy, Midwestern and Greek Life alum. Thank you for being here today, Connie. Thank you. So today we brought you here to talk about the Greek Commons and your role in the upcoming changes for Greek Life here at Midwestern. So first, can you tell us a bit about your background here at MSU? Well, I grew up in Wichita Falls, and so when it was time to go to college, I didn't have any other choice but Midwestern, and it was wonderful. I started school and right after I graduated and then I didn't pledge until the next semester. Gotcha. So why is growing not only this campus as a whole but specifically Greek life important to you? Well Greek life is so important to the campus. It uh, has proven fact that Greek alumni are much more involved in the university than normal alumni mm. and so we uh, I just feel like it's a win-win for both organizations. Right, and when you were a collegiate student, what drew you to Greek life? Um, I have a sister, but she's quite a bit older than I am, and so I really, and most of my friends went away to school, so I was really looking for that connection mm -hmm. to the campus and an easier way to make friends and get involved. And how has being a part of Greek life affected the rest of your life? Oh, I've learned, I've gained so much more from being a Greek member and being in Sigma Kappa than I ever thought I would. It's given me self-confidence. Um, I've been able to travel and do things I wouldn't have been able to do otherwise. So it's really enhanced me. And I have hundreds of young ladies that I can call my sisters and super close friends. Mm -hmm. That's great. And how did you get involved with the renovation of the Daniel Building? Well, I served as advisor to Sigma Kappa for over 26 and a half years, and um, it became obvious that the current building and facility was, we had definitely outgrown it, and it needed major repairs that we couldn't, couldn't be done. Mm -hmm. And um, so I started talking to the university and different people and trying to come up with something different that we could do for all the Greeks. That's awesome. And when are they planning on starting the construction for it? I'm not 100% sure. A lot of it depends on the f moving the, uh, the automobiles and all of that stuff, the fleet, exactly when they can get that done. They're hoping that the Greeks can be in the temporary facilities in 2018, 20, no, 2019. Gotcha. Fall. And what exactly are they doing to the building? To Daniel? Yes. Um, it's going to be a three-phase project. Uh, the first thing they're going to do is move all of the Midwestern fleet to a safer place. And then they're going to take some of those bays and make them temporary sorority facilities. Gotcha. Then long-term, they're remodeling the other part of the building and uh, moving a lot of student services over there. There's going to be a 150 seat theater. There'll be a cafe on the corner with outdoor seating. And the upstairs portion of the building will become uh, large suites for more than the four sororities. So they'll be able to have additional rooms if any of the fraternities or if we finally expand and have other sororities. And where do you see Greek life at Midwestern 10 years from now? Well, I hope it's grown. We're uh, we're kind of stagnated uh, because we don't have the facilities and everything to really expand to the extent that we would like to. I know the university would like for us to add another sorority besides the four that are here. There's just not space for them. Right. And can you tell me about the dedication event happening tomorrow? I'm not real sure what all's happening. I just know they're having a, a luncheon to introduce the building, the the plans for the building and everything to the, mostly I think to the university. Gotcha. Well, that's all the time we have left. Connie, thank you so much for joining us. And don't forget to follow us on Instagram and Twitter at MNG Media and like us on Facebook. For Mustangs Corner, I'm Jessica Wollenberger.